It's time for What's New, the show that features the latest developments in the software industry that are driving innovation today. What's New is on the air right now. Hi, I'm Larry Gregory. I'm here with Rod and Jeff from API Software. Rod is the chief uh, architect and Jeff is the chief technologist. So welcome. Uh, API is a uh, provider of human capital uh, management software for the healthcare industry. And we have them today to uh, discuss some of their innovations they've been taking on lately uh, in WPF and Silverlight. So uh, how can, uh, tell us what you're up to. Uh, API is currently uh, moving its uh, payroll and HR application to uh, uh, the latest Microsoft platform that includes uh, WPF, uh, Silverlight, and WCF. We uh, essentially are using, uh, for the core knowledge worker, we're using the WPF piece. And then for the uh, touching every employee in the hospital, we're using uh, Silverlight. And those technologies are connecting uh, over WCF to a service backend. Okay, and, and how does that translate in terms of actual customer value? What's the benefit? Um, there, there's two value points. The, the first one has to do with the richness of the client. Um, our current user base is, is essentially a Windows client, which is a rich native environment. And uh, our options of moving them to just a, a web application isn't desirable for that type of user. So we felt that WPF with its rich uh, uh, visual uh, experience is uh, an excellent technology. Um, and when we saw Silverlight and how similar it was, uh, we felt we'd do the same experience for the employee also. Okay. Um, our other value proposition, which is more on our side, is the, uh, uh, is the development uh, environment, essentially allowing us to separate the visual designer role from the software engineering role and to allow them to collaborate together on it. Okay, and so as you think about what other people in your position, you know, technical, technical leaders at software companies, uh, if they're going down this path of WPF and Silverlight, what, what guidance or advice would you give them? Plan. Plan. Plan, plan very well. The, the issue is to make sure that you got an architecture in place that allows you to, to morph, migrate, and enhance your application over time without pulling the rug out from under with your clients. So we believe that the platform's now at a point where it's extremely stable, we get the performance from it, and it enables us to guarantee that, that our end users will have a very satisfying experience across the lifespan of the application. Excellent. We're, we're also using the, the MVC model uh, with uh, the Silverlight piece, um, which is an excellent architectural decision uh, for planning for the future. So that would be recommended also. Okay, so speaking of the future, what, what's the next wave of innovation for, for API software? Well, we would not, uh, not be surprised to see us moving that end operational model into the cloud because the, the number one issue in the client community is, shall we say, uneven operational experience on the part of the, the various institutions. And the better able we are to achieve a stable, supportive operational environment with consistent SLAs, consistent QoS, we think that um, the overall experience will be best for them and the sleepless nights will disappear for us. So. <laughs> Rod, Jeff, thank you very much for joining us today and sharing your thoughts.